Hey guys, this is Shainu. Today I'll be showing you how you can block advertisements in YouTube and in Safari for absolutely free. Before I continue with this video, I wanted to mention why Luna is no longer working. This is a similar method to Luna, but in this case, you don't necessarily have to download any sort of extension or anything. It's just an application that comes straight from the App Store. So the reason why Luna got removed from the App Store is because, um, as you remember from the video, to actually have the ad block extension, you need to consent for them to collect your personal data, which is a big no-no for Apple, uh, which I you know kind of respect. That being said, this is the only workaround as of right now to block all the advertisements in YouTube because I know how annoying it can be in YouTube with all the damn advertisements that they have. One in the beginning, one in the end, one in the middle. I'm, oh my God, this is ridiculous. Anyway, let's get into the video. First thing you need to do is you need to go into the App Store. Once you have App Store opened up, search for Adblock Pro for Safari. Go ahead, install it into your device. All right, once the app is installed in our device, we're gonna go ahead, open it up. And here it's going to ask us to go into our settings and enable a bunch of these content blocker methods. So to do that, what we need to do is we need to go into the settings and scroll down until you find Safari. Scroll down to content blockers. And here, as you can see, you have a bunch of extensions almost like uh, that gives you the ability to block advertisement and a bunch of other features. So we're going to go ahead and enable all of them and go back to Adblock Pro. And it says that's are enabled and it's finished and welcome, blah, blah. You got a confetti effect to it and I'm not going to read it now. And that's pretty much it. You just need to come back down here. You know, if any of this is unblocked or, un, you know, toggled off, you can just toggle back on and, and you can customize it the way you like. So I want to show you now a demo of how that looks in Safari. So if you were to go into Safari, and I'm just going to type in maybe the term blog, you will see advertisements. You used to see advertisements on the top and the bottom. So I'm going to go ahead and open up Chrome to compare with Safari, and then type in the word blog. And as you can see, we have an advertisement up here from this. Let's go into youtube.com because obviously you're here for YouTube. As you can see, once you have YouTube open up, you have an advertisement on the top here. And if you were to select any other videos, you are not, you know, you're gonna see a bunch of these advertisements at the, in the beginning, in the middle, and in the end. And if you were to compare it with Safari, you will not see an advertisement on the top and it's just gonna be videos. And again, this is a good workaround for the time being. If there's something better, I will definitely let you know. This will not work in the YouTube application, guys. This will not work in the YouTube application. I say that again because I know I'm going to have some comments asking this question. Thank you so much for watching this video. I really do appreciate your time. Um, if you like this video, make sure you like and subscribe to the channel. I do similar content to this like every week almost. Um, and also make sure to turn on your notification if you haven't already. I'll see you all in the next one. Take care, guys. Bye.